know, what is it? It's the old <laughs> testicle or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> Inside this book be loads of wicked stories about Jewel history. I is a wicked fan of Noah. What a geez, hey, Southend could learn a few things from Noah. He's got all the animals on the boat. Two by two to make sure they could all get jiggy. <laughs> <laughs> and then there was that story of uh, how do you, it happens about Christmas time. What's it called? Chanuka or something. <laughs> there was a miracle on Chanuka when they ran out of massage oil or something like that. And then there was like this big miracle and they found out this little drop was actually enough to last to keep eight ladies nice and chilled. And now, you light a candle for each one of them ladies, respect. But my main shout out goes to my main man, Moses. Make some noise for Moses in the house. Wow, well, Moses! Look up the Moses. What a geezer. He had to travel for years through the desert. If oh my much God. of that, if I understood correctly, he had to suffer the discomfort of a burning bush. Oh! <laughs> It's probably from all the sand or something like that. <laughs> something I think Majuli can relate to anyway. But that wasn't the worst of it. He then got sent to the top of the massive mountain to receive the law. And apparently, when he got it, it was so complicated, he had to drop two tablets just to try and get his head round it. <laughs> Respect! But now he's here to learn a little bit more about what it is to be part of the Jew crew, aight? Aight. Aight. Respect. Respect. So, Respect. without further ado... <laughs> oh, hi! <laughs> That's my little joke there, yeah. <laughs> It's time to big up the main man of the minute, innit? So make some noise for the main geezer at the hour. We're gonna ask him a few questions up here. Make some noise for Jordan in the hour! <laughs> Make some noise for Jordan in the house. <laughs> Jordan, nice to meet you, Rupa. Give us a mic check. Let's know that it's working. Mic yeah. check. Hello. Hello. You can hear him. Yes, right. sir. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Wicked. I hope that wasn't a defect of the mic. It sounded a little squeaky there, Jordan. I thought. Uh, no, we okay. Yeah. Is you got? Is you rubbing a mic on your afro? I can hear like all these people. <laughs> Okay, so Jordan, let me start by uh, wishing you Mazel Matov. Mazel Matov. Respect. <laughs> Check it. What is... Anything I can do to stop that? No? Is that... Is that oh, chasing me. <laughs> I think the tide's coming back in and we can hear it on the mic. Jordan, give me the breakdown. What is or why is a bow mitzvah important? <laughs> Uh, it's when a Jewish boy turns into a man in the eyes of the Jewish law. It's when you turn a boy turns into a man. Yeah. Respect. And how old is you? Uh, Thirteen. No way. <laughs> Respect. I was feeling that. I was well impressed because I was a little bit older than thirteen when me first became a man. <laughs> And I was pretty sure I didn't invite this many people to watch. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Oh my gosh! Oh, shit, guys. Oh my that. gosh! <laughs> that is well impressive. That is well impressive. It is. So, now that you is a man, Giza, can you explain to me the clean parts? What actually happens on the main day? It was like yesterday or something? What What happened yesterday? Well, I read from the Torah. I had a what is the Torah? It's the five books of Moses. You uh, had to read five books? I ain't read that in my whole life. <laughs> <laughs> Even the Harry Potters me gave up on. Like seven of them or something. Five books. <laughs> no, so how long did people have to stick around and listen to that for? <laughs> so I had a selected portion, which was only about... Um, Oh, okay. So it's like the highlights. It's like reading the back of it or whatever. <laughs> we all do that to cheat a little bit. And what is you actually reading? What is it? Uh, Hebrew. Hebrew. That's like the Jew language, isn't it? Yeah. And does you know Hebrew from a young age? Was you taught it or did you have to learn it? What's the process? Uh, I was taught... 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 I was
then I came back to it, and then I learned my other bit. Okay, so you learnt it, and do you, I mean, do you now know this? How did he do, by the way? Did he do it well? Yeah! yeah. Respect, respect. You've got your proper crew in the house tonight, isn't it? And how long did it, I mean, do you know this off by heart now? Uh, no, not particularly. You can't, if someone didn't have the books in front of you, you couldn't <laughs> no, put a rewind on it. Even a little, half. About half, like the first paragraph or something. <laughs> Okay, so maybe we'll do, do a little rewind on that a little bit later on. So that is the Torah. Is it, and it's literally just a book or a sheet of paper or what? It's a scroll. It's a scroll. Actually, I think I've seen them things. You actually have to sort of roll it up, innit? Yes. Oh my that God. That is so wicked because there ain't many religious texts that you actually can sign up with, innit? Oh, and, oh wow. Trust me, I have tried. Oh, wow. I have had a go with that. <laughs> 